Hi everyone and welcome to this blockchain channel. In this video we are talk about Ethereum 2.0 coming. An improved ETH is coming with the Ethereum 2.0 release, with the next phase coming in September. Ethereum is soon due for an upgrade to version 2.0, but when is the Ethereum 2.0 release date? With Ethereum 2.0, known as Serenity, ETH will soon transition away from proof of work, POW. Algorithms, also used in Bitcoin mining. Instead, it will move towards proof of stake, POS, and Ethereum staking. The upgrade will bring changes that will, according to Ethereum, make the currency more scalable, more secure, and more sustainable. Initially slated for a 2019 release, Ethereum 2.0 has undergone several hefty delays during its development period. The next step in the Ethereum upgrade is the Ethereum merge date. Based on the latest scheduling, the Ethereum merge will happen on September 19, 2022. This event will merge the mainnet with Ethereum 2.0's beacon chain, enabling full staking. After this, Ethereum shard chains will launch in 2023, increasing the blockchain capacity. This is a slight delay on a previously expected August date for the merge. During the permissionless conference, Ethereum core developer Preston Van Loon said, as far as we know, if everything goes to plan, August. It just makes sense. This comes after the Ethereum difficulty bomb finally went off at the end of June. Prior to this, the Robson testnet merged with the Beacon chain on June 8th. Ethereum 2.0 Roadmap Vitalik Buterin has now given a more comprehensive look at what's next on the Ethereum 2.0 roadmap for after the merge. The merge is just one of the distinct sections in Ethereum's upgrades. These are, the beacon chain, the merge, and sharding. The beacon change, phase 0, which implemented the POS algorithm, first launched in December 2020. Compared to POW algorithms, POS is less energy intensive. Ethereum staking is currently being tested. This substantial phase will merge the beacon chain into the mainnet and see the end of POW algorithms. This is the current stage of Ethereum, with the merge set to happen in a couple of months. However, when speaking at FCC in Paris, Buterin said Ethereum will only be 55% finished once the merge is deployed, with more updates coming afterwards. The final upgrade mapped out for F2 will see the implementation of shard chains. Introducing sharding to Ethereum 2.0 should allow for heightened scaling of Ethereum, as transactions can be split across 64 new chains. In a keynote at the Singapore University of Social Sciences, Ethereum's co-founder Vitalik Buterin described this scaling as even more important than proof of stake. With so many new NFT projects launching and increasing the demand on the blockchain, this could be vital for Ethereum. Overall, the Ethereum 2.0 transactions per second could reach 100,000. Indeed, the Ethereum gas fees after the merge will likely remain fairly similar. It is only when sharding is implemented that these may drop. Of course, Ethereum 2.0's current plans are not set in stone, with the Ethereum website cautioning. The latest Ethereum update was the Altair upgrade, set to be the first major update to the beacon change since it released. Altair launched on October 27th. Ethereum burn rate. How much ETH has burned since EIP-1559 London hard fork? Ethereum 2.0 price As with all things crypto, many Ethereum holders are wondering how the upgrade will impact the price of ETH. We won't be speculating on any Ethereum price action here, but Ethereum's co-founder Vitalik Buterin has touched upon this in an interview with Bankless. Meanwhile, other Ethereum holders are hoping to see the flippening, a fabled event in which Ethereum would overtake the Bitcoin market cap. Currently, the Bitcoin market cap is double that of Ethereum. As with all crypto prices, nothing is guaranteed, so we'll need to wait until the next launches to see what happens. Is Ethereum 2.0 a new coin? Ethereum 2.0 is not a new coin, and will not change the amount of ETH you hold. In terms of Ethereum versus Ethereum 2.0, F2 is simply an upgrade that will improve the Ethereum blockchain. It will more likely have an impact on Ethereum miners rather than holders, as the shift to POS will see staking take over from mining to approved transactions on the Ethereum blockchain. Latest Ethereum News Today In the latest Ethereum News Today, the crypto market is discussing the fabled event dubbed the flippening as the Ethereum price source. According to a Bloomberg report, Arcas Bodhi Pinkner believes that it's quite possible that the soaring ETH merge price may trigger flippening, an event where the price of Ethereum overpowers the price of Bitcoin 
which is the largest cryptocurrency by market cap. Many continue to predict that Ethereum's widely anticipated merge event is a golden chance for the blockchain to flip Bitcoin for good. However, this remains pure speculation on their part, and should not be interpreted or used as financial advice. Elsewhere, lead Ethereum developer Tim Bako has also confirmed a new date for the Gorley testnet merge. This will be the last testnet merge the network is expected to undergo before deployment of the final merge. The Gorley testnet merge will be completed between August 6 to 12. Alongside this latest Ethereum news, more information continues to come out about the impact the Ethereum merge will have. Co-founder Vitalik Buterin has given several thoughts about the future of the blockchain, noting this transition to POS is merely 50% of the entire Ethereum roadmap. Future upgrades, mainly staking, for example, will see Ethereum reach up to 100,000 TPS. Ethereum gas fees after the merge will likely remain similar, for it is this sharding upgrade that could help here. Sometimes the Binance app not working properly may want to compel you to delete your Binance account out of sheer frustration. But it can be fixed so let's just relax a bit there. Like any other Android or iOS app, Binance, the cryptocurrency exchange app is also susceptible to frequent crashing issues. This can be annoying, especially for investors looking to make timely crypto trades. So, how do you fix that crippling issue at the earliest? Binance, one of the top crypto exchanges in the world, has an Android and iOS application that offers its users a diverse range of cryptocurrencies. Listed on the exchange. Used by more than 25 million users, it's no wonder this can sometimes result in the app getting overwhelmed and crashing down. Frequent system updates released by the Binance developers may often pose incompatibility issues with the current mobile phone model. Although it might happen rarely, sometimes such updates can result in the app crashing more frequently. Storage issues with the current phone model can also sometimes result in the malfunctioning of the Binance app. Full cache memory is also one of the key reasons why certain apps including Binance can keep crashing when trying to open the app for trading or viewing. As we fast approach the Ethereum merge date, the latest Ethereum news today remains focused on the near future of ETH. With the Ethereum 2.0 release date closer than ever, ETH holders are awaiting the upcoming blockchain upgrade that will see the switch over from Ethereum mining to Ethereum staking. Thanks for watching.